No, 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 Sonic the Hedgehog. I guess like an April Fool's thing from Sega, but at the same time, it's like a real game. Features, I believe, nearly every single character from the Sonic uh, the Hedgehog franchise. I guess we'll uh, dive straight on into it, honestly, and see who killed Sonic the Hedgehog. Oh, we have to fill out the name. What should my name be, chat? My first thought is these nuts. Ginger, how dare you? How dare you attack me for how I look? I could go with Mike Hawk. I want to call him the devil. It's me, the devil. I've come to make you commit sin, Shadow. The dining car. Oh, are we in the Orient Express? Working the train's dining car can be uh, so bad. Come on, the devil is shaking it off. Come <laughs> on, the devil shaking it off. It's already getting good, this. Oh shit, what the fuck? The devil, did I uh, just see you hitting yourself? No. Mr. Kondota, sir, how are you doing this morning? Ho, 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 green giant. Right, all right to myself, though, feeling a bit, a uh, little bit of sweet. Everything all right? The uh, truth be told, not really. Alas, today is my last day as a to Always retiring after 32 years on the job. Damn. Time for me and the Mirage Express to say goodbye one last one to another. So this is his last trip then. Oh, congratulations on the retirement, sir. Thank you. My wife is very excited about it. She's already got our play tickets to Sagagonia. Sagonia. Our shower has been in on the fridge, so I'm excited to use the hotels. <laughs> Fair enough. Enough of my rules. Uh, today, your first day working in the tiny car. Here's the menu for today. Okay. Oh, look at that. The main menu. Chili dogs, ramen, or chicken conda bleu. Why do you look so nervous? All we have to do on the train is uh, Michael. <laughs> So it's all microwaved. Oh, ha, 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 ha. That's the truest evil in this game chat. Everything's microwaved. Now, let's all, uh, show a little quizzes in order. Which of these do we serve in the dining car? Crab rang Rangoon. Spicy Grilled Picky. I don't know what either of these are. Chicken Cordon Bleu. Can you can, can read the menu? Okay, yes. So about uh, the vessel is uh, this is a state-of-the-art high-speed smart train with all the latest gadgets. Ooh. The drink in here, you really handle anything you can throw at it. Like a boulder, maybe? The train is exclusively used for events. It's not a passionate train. So it's basically a special event train where people like can get tickets and go on it. So they have a day start? Or, I hope so. Remember that from the uh, interview what's the event today a murder mystery party nothing better than someone some thrills to end my train tenure as a conductor okay so we're doing a murder mystery party on the train yes we'll be funneled here to the dining car as a home base uh, to as to speak i'll be with you to go over tickets but after that you'll be on your own great good on the first day that i get supervised for like five minutes and then nothing typical freaking corporate people yeah. But I need you to do everything in your power to make sure our ping uh, gifts are well taken care of, understood. No pressure. Doors to the Mars Express are opening all board. Sweet. That looks pretty cool. Oh, that, that's Amy. That's Knuckles. That's definitely Sonic there. Oh, Amy looks pretty cute in her outfit. I still hate her. Oh, it's Tails. Look at her outfit. He looks like Sherlock Holmes. The train is incredible. What a fascinating tech. Fa tech. Yeah, they're all dressed up for the murder mystery party. And Vector's here as well. Big crocodile chain. Sherlock Tails, exactly. I can't even uh, can get used to staying on a train like this. What did you all expect? You know it. I always go out for my birthday. Oh, it's Amy's birthday. Oh, that explains it then. So Amy decided to pick out this murder mystery mystery party thing for her birthday. Ah, Rouge is here as well. The train is as elegant as you are. Ah, oh, Amy, can't wait. I promise I won't take it if it no. Still a thief at heart. Calm down there, Rouge. Did I not uh, just catch you stealing from me that from the train gift shop? It was a pen knucklehead. That's probably her nickname, right? What cast of characters I am stuck with you? <laughs> Yeah, you're not wrong. Get a hold of yourself, sorry, uh, the devil. <laughs> if I could find Shadow in this game as the devil, that would be fantastic. Oh, look, it's Sonic. And he's, he's a sailor. Cool. Can I uh, get one of those jelly dogs? Yeah, absolutely. Arr, are you a pirate? No, I'm more nervous than I thought. Wait until I announce everyone's roles to get food. Aw, he's hungry. You can't let Sonic starve. He's hungry. Are we going around to collect everyone's tickets? Please have the arm ready. Yep. Just click on, just click on whoever you'd like to talk with and you'll take like, the tickets from. Okay, cool. So I can I can click on any of them. Oh, another character there too. Shadow in the background. Let's see how the shadow. Shadow, it's me, the devil. Is there anything we can help you with? Do you sell gift bags here? Uh, uh, sadly, no. Well, no, we have, I have not taken that. No. But I have a plastic grocery bag in the back I could uh, get for you. That's there. <laughs> so cold. That is Shadow in a nutshell. Edgy bastard that he is. The devil, you're shivering. Do you need you to fetch your jacket? No, I'm, just, I'm pretty sure he just knows I'm trying to commit sin. Take it, please. Espio. Espio, I believe, is from Sonic Heroes, if I recall. Excellent. Thank you, and I hope you enjoy your stay with us. Absolutely. I appreciate it. There's a calmness about him. Something about his presence puts me at ease. 
on that channel. You consider me calming? Yeah. He's looking right at me. I study ninjutsu. I believe that no one can communicate. One can communicate with through the subconscious. Can you cling to walls? What is can you? Oh, you most certainly can. There you go. That's the answer. All right, let's go for the crocodile. Take it, please. I don't know. Of, of, of upstanding uh, morals, I'd love to show you my tickets. He seems to be avoiding. Uh, does he have? Did, has he lost it? Ah, oh, he's lost his ticket. Yeah, he's not hiding his embarrassment very well. He even turns up here. That's very nice. Looking, not to actually look around. Most people just it looks like ask him to leave. Then keep her eyes peeled out for his ticket. Right. Take it, please. Oh, there we go. That was very quick. A princess such as myself must always be punctual. I didn't know Blaze was a was a princess. You don't mind me asking, are you visiting from somewhere? Different dimension, actually. Oh, different dimension. So she's a princess from a different dimension. Do I see a famous birthday now? I'll hop back into my own dimension. Fair enough. I prefer the birthday cake from this world more than my own, so I may I'll be excited. Cakes does sound pretty good. Should I bow? Do I bow before a princess? Um, sure. What are you doing? Please get sorry. That's not a rouge. You know, it wouldn't surprise me if Rouge stole the ticket from the crocodile. Hey yo. Wait, what the fuck? Wow. Oh, Rouge is getting rusty. May not actually be the best uh, judge character. Yeah. Take it, please. There we are. Thank you for choosing our fine train for your best birthday festivities. Yes. The bit <laughs> that she got a birthday discount. Of course she did. Of course she did. Who doesn't love a birthday guy? No, right? Is Amy already drunk? Give it time. If she isn't already drunk now, she probably will be. Murder train just uh, sounds so exciting right up my alley. You see, I'm a girl who loves a good uh, true crime podcast. Ah, she probably follows all of them then. Boy, move along, you, you miss. Oh, it locked any door in the train. So she has basically the multi pass. Use it with, yeah, with great power comes great responsibility, and Amy will not use it responsibly. Let's see. Oh, wait. Did I just find his ticket there? I might have found something. The devil has found the ticket. There you go. The knight had to hand that to the conductor. The devil here would have uh, the hands looking at you up, probably. But I am the devil, so, you know. Wait, who uh, made me both microwave expert and security guard? The conductor did. All the hosp hospitality. You gotta do multiple things. All right, so the la last ones to talk to, I think, are Sonic, Tails, and Knuckles. Howdy. <laughs> Just going straight for the howdy there because of the cowboy hat. I think that's a ticket. But I really don't want to argue with this guy. Yeah, it is. No, it's Knuckles. Knuckles will punch you if you like, you know, step out of bounds of him. Can I go take a young one? Yeah, there we go. There as well. Sparkle gelatin. It's a sparkly jelly that can melt on any uh, jaded heart. Cool. Wait, I brought my own too? Wow, we're, <laughs> we're sparkle gelatin buddies. Sparkle gelatin buddies. And finally, Sonic. Dig, please. There we are. When Emma took over, I truly feared the worst, but my kids swore... Oh, you would swoop in eventually, and you did. Ah, yes, yeah. Sonic and Eggman. Two rivals that will never, like, start battle with each other. Wait a second, is he the Sonic? Yeah, he is the Sonic the Hedgehog. Okay, everyone, time for me to read uh, everyone's roles for the murder mystery. Sweet. And that's a that's cue to leave. Wow. So now I'm left on my own to deal with all these lot. Yes, that, that is the plan. That is the hope. That is the plan. Hopefully nothing goes wrong. To be honest, this group seems to be capable on their own. True. Okay, so the train is its own little AI system. Okay, that's pretty cool. Love more heart woman than a conductor in his train. <laughs> True. Okay, so apparently he's like he's basically giving them permission to go wild. Don't. They will. And they'll probably wreck the entire place. Please talk to the Trinidad devil here if you need anything. Yes. The devil will have all your needs met. Thank you all for following the outfit guide I sent to you. All look amazing. I trust you all read, read your lore guard cards. Oh, lore. Now on to the nitty gritty. For the murder mystery game of one of you is will be murdered. And the rest of us arrest the past suspects. Everyone has assigned roles for a character. Uh, they'll be playing participants where attention is uh, required for it's my birthday. Fair enough. Okay, so as the ship captain, you'll be stationed in the conductor car. Cool. Tails, you're the detective, as I kind of suspected with the Sherlock Holmes outfit. Knuckles, you're the sheriff. Ah, so that explains the cowboy outfit, I guess. Rouge, you're, you're a business tycoon, and Blaze, you're a titan in the industry, both in the, in the casino. So they're both like casino workers then. Okay, Vector is the butcher, and SPO is the poet. Shadow is the locksmith, hanging out in the lounge. Okay. Okay. You're the journalist reporter. I'll be moseying around with everyone. Okay. Do you all get that? Yes, I think so. Well, then, all right. You can always ensure everyone's following their rules. All that reminds me. Okay, so we got a map to follow then of where everyone is. The rules of the game are as follows. There is a murderer amongst you all. The murderer can kill a single participant however they choose, but must physically be present with the victim for its count. Okay. 
Everyone else must collect evidence throughout the train and use it to interrogate fellow passengers to figure out who done it. The murderer will lie to get out of being accused, so inspect everyone you, I mean, you can find clues and interrogate. I'll set a time for one hour so everyone can mingle. The, red, the murderer can do their thing. Is everyone ready? Sounds like everyone's excited. All right then, chat. The murderer shall begin soon. Aw. Amy's liking this. Mystery is unfolding right under our very noses. How thrilling. Couldn't you two be out there mingling with everyone? Well, actually, detective and journalist can't be the murderer. Okay, so there's two exceptions to the murderer then. So it's okay for now before going out and scooping the, the plus. Okay, let's open the place. Cool. This way, there's always a neutral party. Fair enough. Since though Amy is more excited about uh, deciphering the mystery anyways. What do you think everyone's doing? Probably mingling. Doing stuff. Shadow's probably like brooding. Oh, probably expecting the station and talking amongst one another. Everyone has roles to play, so they must be exploring their characters. You know what kind of character motivations are. Oh, okay. So they're low cast confidential, so Amy doesn't even know who's like what and who's being murdered then, I guess. My story is that uh, I was best friends with Flicky that decided to join the evil Dr. Eggman, restarting my cat desire to justice. Oh, okay. Kind of a Batman scenario here then. Justice. My lord's that a nosy person. <laughs> I mean, that's basically Amy in a nutshell, that nosy person. Oh? Okay, the train's moving. Uh, what's going on? What's happening? Huh? Um, did the train just crash? Yeah, we're, we're good. What the fuck just happened? Everyone all right? It's pretty bit, but I'm okay. Okay. Yeah, we've been knocked into the diner's car's closet. The train can reach uh, such incredible speed. It's like a Japanese train. Yeah, now money's worth an experience, that's for sure. I hope this is part of this big experience. We should go on the oh, I'll check on the others. The devil could uh, get the door. Okay. The devil's power then. Don't think I'll be budging. We have to get out of the way. Give this a shelf a whack with your Pico Pico hammer. Let me guess, she forgot it. Okay, she forgot her hammer, didn't she? She's hiding something. Yeah, she forgot her hammer. Lord detectives, best detectives have uh, psychics. I'm gonna need your help. So I guess I'm being Tails' psychic here. Why am I acting this way and interrogate her about it? Okay. She got everything you can around this closet, and then we'll, we'll show it to uncover. I'm pretty sure I know the mystery. I think she's forgotten her hammer. That's the mystery. Like you're evil. <laughs> yeah, I won't turn evil. The devil won't turn evil. It looks like the main things I can examine are these things here. Normally never microwave meals. I prefer to cook my cast iron. As Ooh, okay. Mean cast iron pizza. I wouldn't mind trying that. What are you doing here, Amy? A spoon. They don't want a spoon chat. We could dig ourselves out with the spoon on the train. Yeah, she's no. Yeah, keep looking. Ooh. Yeah, it did get smacked. Maybe she did hit it with the hammer beforehand. Maybe she broke her hammer. Okay, there's nothing in the in the bin. Anything else that I can explore? Oh, what's that? She did break it. That's her hammer, right? She broke it. Interrogation time. Yes, I am. It doesn't matter if it's your birthday or not. We'll see if we suspect something. We are going to interrogate you. How dare you? How dare you hide the truth? Lord of all, what I think of hiding from you. Yeah, she's hiding something for sure. Microwave the chili dog attempted to escape. I think it attempted to escape. Show me the evidence I attempted to escape on this stick. Final copy of evidence from your inventory. Okay. Once they have to do this, where we must uh, form our argument to fight back. Okay. Kind of reminds me of Ace Attorney a little bit. We have this the stick. Okay, what about this? The crack on the shelf. You're yeah, rasping. Now we follow this train of four orders. How does the crack on the shelf relate to Amy? Objection. What would Sonic do? Uh, probably stare her down until she eventually like cracks. He's always uh running and forward collecting rings, crushing bandit, uh, bad necks. He never fails. It loses. Like an endless running game, running game. I play a lot of those on my phone. Like. Temple run. Close your eyes and think, what would Sonic do in uh, Find Your Argument? Okay, that's what Tails advises. Let's just do that. Okay. So we gotta come up with some good. Oh, what the fuck? Do we have to like, actually play a mini game? Okay, then. Okay. Nice. I think I'm good. What's this? Have we exposed the truth here? Show the shelf open, but there's nothing around here for the shelf to fall onto. Tell me on the train that this will care that the damage was here before we arrived. Well, the, I... I believe someone wants for hitting the shelf. You just said nothing about I was around for the shelf to be fell onto it. What was the shelf hit with then? This. Uh, you truly believe that... I mean, it's... I think, okay, here we go. 
Let's do it again now. Now we need 25 coins. All right, there we go. So it is like a temple run mini game, this in the game. But if it's attached to something that could be, uh, let's just say, a hammer. Hammer. Yeah, I, that, that's what I thought too. That it was the hammer to a pickle pickle hammer, which she broke. Yeah, there it is. She's cracking, chat. But I failed. She failed part miserably. Here's the shelf. One big whack and the handle ripped her right off. Damn. It was no big deal trying to hide it, but I suppose my embarrassment got the better of me. She does look genuinely sorry about the situation. She's doing her little, little uh, pouty, like, innocent face now where I'm sorry. A little Lights of this carry. I didn't want to think I needed it. Okay. So it was a less weaker, it was a weaker backup hammer that she has. How many hammers does Amy have again? Well, luckily for you, uh, lucky for you, I have a protective and devil as a mechanic. Let's see. Let me see both player pieces of the hammer. Yes. Just tighten things here and a little elbow grease in there. Bear fix. Oh my calculations if you calculations, if you hit the shelf right here, you should do the trick. Sweet. Yeah, be careful with it though. You already broke it once. Nice. There we are. We're free. Freedom. Oh my God. What the fuck happened? Shit. Sonic's dead. Someone murdered my darling Sonic. I was like, the game's begun. I'm finding out who did this at once. Anyway, wait. I want to figure out who did this too. Wait for me. Well, I guess I'm left alone then. That was really quick in Sonic. Uh, is Sonic actually dead? Body numb. Can't move. What are you saying? I don't understand. I just need to rest. Oh. Is he actually hurt or is he just like pretending? Sonic might actually be in trouble here. Well, but we're reminded again here, chat. We have to take care of everyone. Okay, so that means I guess we have to just leave Sonic alone. The saloon car. Oh my God, who broke the machine? Amy, Amy, are you here? Look around, I don't see her. I mean, Amy's already gone ahead and seems he's really excited. Do you think someone's, uh, need something from me? Well, yeah, it's just a question, really. How do I put this? What if Sonic is actually hurt? Ha, 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 ha. doesn't, like, agree with that. Sonic doesn't go down so easily. He's on a train full of his friends. Nothing uh, would actually happen to him. We're all just all really committed to the mystery for Amy. You have nothing to worry about, promise. Okay, sure. But Sonic likes to nap and... <laughs> It wouldn't surprise me if he was actually just napping. I'm a lot since I can't shake what Sonic said to me. Is this really part of the murder mystery game or is there something deeper happening? Would you mind if it's cool if I tag along with you? Of course, uh, sure. Now if I ever need a snack, snack, you've got me. I'm a snack buddy. If you ever catch me looking glum though, just know it's because, um, where's my law card? The last guy to work in the case we ditched our practice and joined the evil Dr. Eggman. There it is. Look at his pouty face as well. That's pretty cute. Yeah, vermin. Oh no, shit. It's Knuckles. What are you doing in my saloon? He's trying to so hard to stay in character. I I don't think he's staying in character. I think that's just actually who he is. He's trying to figure out who murdered Sonic. I can see that. Uh, my Amy bounced the uh, brew and told me all about it. <laughs> Enough of that. I wonder how long he kept that voice up for Amy. Probably a while. Well, we were wondering if you could tell us uh, about where you were before the murder. Anything to help us with your that was your alibi and nope i have nothing to say, tell you either of you wow being very very closed off there and cautious leave me alone wow he's actually about something but well why take it out on us i know better than uh to argue with knuckles so it seems we're on our own Adele, we need to figure out what happened uh what knuckles was up to while we were all apart let's investigate for our clues and then interrogate okay well the machine here is broken i'm gonna guess that knuckles got very angry at it super monkey ball as well god damn that's a good game do we think it broke when the train sped up the damage looked more caused by punches i mean i'm assuming knuckles got a little angry at the game and that's why he's pouting what are you two looking at me for come on yeah smash arcade game bowl of assorted nuts a classic saloon snack Kind of bland. Oh, maybe they're just unsalted. Hopefully it's the case. Like, oh my God, ew. Anything in the bin? This one's empty, okay. You never know, it could happen. Let's see, what's this? And if you uh, use cups, yeah. Why are they free? Good question, because there is only Knuckles here. Knuckles was really thirsty, maybe. Well, I'm suspecting one of them has lipstick on the rim. By chance, was Rouge here, Knuckles? I think a lot of that, yeah, sure. Do we have enough clues for Knuckles? Well, I guess we've got to go and interrogate knuckles now i like your hat oh he's getting quite shy uh not hungry okay that's fair enough we you know like a butcher butler of souls right come on the devil you're not a butler talk tell him that yeah like yeah like a butler sure thank you butler now he's known as butler great time to start the interrogation during the hour the murder took place okay I already told you, buzz off, you're not getting anything uh, out of me. Thankfully, we don't need to say much, but how happened here is pretty obvious. Is it? We have evidence too. We do? The devil will just take a look at our inventory. What was attracted to Knuckles during the time Sonic was murdered? There's a smashed arcade machine right here. What do you think I touched it? Well, okay. Oh, yeah. This isn't a tough one, Knuckles. Knuckles, you clearly touched the arcade machine because... 
The monk ball is your favorite game. The arcade cabinet is covered in punches. Your hair was found at the scene. Is it his favorite game though? What are you staring at? Come on. You could have destroyed the arcade machine, but why? I need a punching bag and none were available to me. So you're using the arcade machine? There was a clear answer. How, how are you? He's, he's a mechanic. Tails is a mechanic. He can just fix things. Oh, okay. Oh, balls. No. There we go. Okay, there we are. Two attempts there. The arcade machine is fixed. Yay. No, don't look at the scores. Oh, no. Let me guess. Did Rouge beat his high score on Super Monkey Ball? Oh, no. Vector did. So Vector beat his high score by one point. Switch your being begin to paint it here. You completed with it. Vector to see who could get the highest score. Vector beat you. Yep, he did. Look at that blushing face. That says everything. Demonstration, you destroy the arcade cabinet. Yeah. He's punching the <laughs> demonstration just like Knuckles. You're guessing. Where's your proof? Where's your evidence? That's a common name. Proof. He's the only other, the only Vector on this freaking like, train. I don't need to prove that. That's a lot of obstacles there. Holy shit. What proves uh, that it was here with Knuckles? Uh, the lipstick, I guess? No! Probably was strange that there was more than one cop sitting there next to you. I was supposed to be perhaps in murder mystery with aiming famous birthday. You and Vector enjoyed some drinks playing arcade. I'm, I'm not, it's not like, ooh. It's not, I wasn't, I don't, don't tell Amy. I think we're on the right track here, yes. So Vector was the one who was having a drink there. That who's say Vector popped in and, uh, at the top of the hour, wanted to play the arcade machine with me. We went back and forth trying to figure out the game, uh, Al, but when we did, we competed for the highest score. When he bested me, I destroyed the machine. No proof of his win, well, apart from when he, like, fixed the machine. I was trying to fix the arcade uh, cabinet before you two came in, honestly. I didn't want to be caught. And that's my story and alibi. I'll... I've already told an average version of this to Amy. Well, this friend group has a lot of, yeah, it, did, it really does. Well, that probably explains one of the uh, used cups. Ah, uh, that's probably Rude, right? Rude was here in here too. Ah, of course. It's incons inconsistent, not worth mentioning. Sounds like someone's getting a little embarrassed there. Just around for something, but failed. Made fun of our game and left. Of not just that one. True. He offered her a drink, apparently. Listen, I don't know why she showed up. I told you everything that happened before the train. I know why. I can figure a reason why she showed up. Uh, are you not satisfied? Will you uh, to relent? Hmm, I'm understanding the scenario. Better bits to play games. Rude couldn't find something and left and Knuckles destroyed the machine. That's all makes sense. Thank you for answering so many of our questions. Actually, that's not everything, is it, Knuckles? Ooh. I want to step back to something I noticed. One more name on that high school. This doesn't make sense. Adele, can you take a look at what one more time? Okay. Apple, bread, ultimate, bagel, candy. Yeah, this one's the only one that doesn't have food related items. Who goes by ultimate? The ultimate life form. Shadow, it's me. Better and I were struggling so much with the game, but then Shadow, Shadow dropped by. So Shadow and Rouge were also here along with Vector. Shadow knows how to play monkey ball. Here it is before he left. Ooh, a key. Come with a locked door not to open it for anyone. Then like, he left. Hmm. Interesting. Better was leaving a locked door behind him, so no one, no one else after leaving the locked door. Okay. So when Amy came through here not too long ago, did you open the door for her? No, I think she had some sort of. Yeah, she got a key from the conductor, then she had to open all doors. Got that to come here. True. Why is she had a locking doors? And what was Rue searching for? I don't know. They didn't tell me, even though I asked where well, with that cowboy accent. <laughs> Playing the character, as always. Wouldn't have to find them by asking yourselves. Okay. More vision I expect to get there, but it seems we can move on. As of right now, I believe your story, Knuckles. We'll only know for sure when we confirm things with Vector. Fair enough. The library is in the next car. I'll open the lock for you. Yay. If anyone, you ever a KO'd nurse, I could earful for me to the tails and the butler. <laughs> and the butler. We'll do share. Come on, the devil. Let's head to the library. Moving on to the next car. Yes, then. All right. Now we're in. Oh, there's a chow poster behind. Behind my webcam is a chow poster. It's just hanging there. It's very cute. All this stuff's getting he heavy. I've done what I don't need. Oh, okay. Oh, there's Amy, along with Vector and Espio. Red now, you'll be uh, powerfully helpful. Alrighty, but you, uh, before you go, Espio and I wanted to give you your presents. Presents? There you are, Amy. Are you finally leads yet? Oh, the detective pair needs to help them with the birthday girl. Yeah. She knows everyone's allowed to be sassy on their birthday. Yeah. Dave is too juicy to ignore. I'll see you all around. Don't worry, Sonic will uh, we'll be the one to avenge you. I'm quick. Oh, no. I'm surprised if Amy was the one who actually killed Sonic, honestly, at this point. How are you going to leave? The door to the... Yeah, he's, she's got the master key. I'll start this gear for anyone else. Bye. Amy may be hateful, but she's thorough. That's true. Now, what are you two doing? Uh, looking at uh, my sus, sus. I'm the detective, so I can uh, be the murderer. I'm at the butcher. I've licensed to handle raw meat. 
I'm gonna steal the poet. Can I hear some? Sure. Um, teardrops in the spring. Can you hear my uh, music? La 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 la. D d d d. That was okay. I have more if you like. Cherry blossoms in the spring. That's that's enough. That's enough. Devil and I are here to establish both of you as uh, alibi eyes. Okay. Can you walk us through what happened after Amy had everyone leave the dining car? Oh, sure. It's simple. We just explained this to Amy, actually. And we were all sent off. Rouge, Blaze, Shadow, and Sonic all passed through this library car. But Amy told me an SP wanted to stay. I picked up a book off the shelf and made myself comfortable. Just started reading. Fair enough. Betsy got bored, so he left to see what Knuckles... Yeah, he went to the left and basically went on the arcade machine and, like, challenged him to a duel. Where was Rouge? What happened to her lips? Staying on the cover at the saloon. Bruce came along to the library car, seemingly looking for something. What is she looking for? Then she went to search for the saloon car. Came back shortly after and heard her shout, No way at the brochure. Shaw stand over there. Then she left to the casino car before Shadow came through and locked the door. Locked the door. Okay. After Rouge left, Shadow walked through the casino car and entered the library car and locked the door behind him. Yeah, why does Shadow keep locking the doors? I mean, he is the locksmith. Maybe that's why. The saloon where Knuckles and I are playing games. He insisted, insisted on showing us up the Super Monkey Ball. He's a gamer, chat. I got so engrossed by the rolling monkey action, I hardly noticed when Shadow left the saloon car. Guess he walked through the library car to the casino car again, locked the door behind him. Then he returned to the lounge car where he uh, has uh, meant to be stationed. When Betsy came back, uh, we realized. I thought locked the door to the saloon car. We were stuck in the library car. Damn. He was making sure all the doors were locked there. That's when the train sped up and we were worried about the deadlock shells falling on us, but we got through it all all right. Okay. We stayed trapped, sat trapped there until Amy arrived to ask some questions. She's the one who told us about Sonic being murdered. Yeah, that's all that happened. Okay. Interesting. With all these locked doors, it seems like veterans people couldn't have left the library card to Luca. No, that's true. They were all locked in, so they couldn't really have gotten to Sonic. Yeah, we'll have a look around. If you return any meter, I'll chop it up for you. Sweet. If you... <laughs> No thanks, FPO, no thanks. That might seem solid enough, but we... At least there are more thorough explaining things than Knuckles were. But yeah, we should still look around for some more clues and see if what they're saying is actually true. We shall have a look around and get to the bottom of all this. The globe. I'd love to visit some of the countries. I I want to do more of that as well in my own world, in this world. That'd be great. Plenty of wonderful people in the shops. The food uh, can't be beat either. Sounds perfect for a vacation. The conductor was talking about Spag uh, Spagonia, if you ever be there. I have actually. If you ever visited Burby, sure to stop by the suit university and say hi to Professor Pickle. Huh? Let's check the bin. Ed's table does nothing here. Damn it! We need to make sure, we need to make sure everything is checked as well. Devil, you're pretty uh, unconventional. I like that, thanks. Ooh, the bookshelves. I'm just gonna stop and look at all these books. I bet you could, you nerd. Some books have fallen out of the ball and everything, but every book on the these shells is alphabetical order, but this one, this one, the Mirage Express Manual, maybe. But it is interesting. Yeah. Ooh, what's this? Of evil scientist Doctor Eggman. Uh oh. Oh, what? Eggman's made an autobiography and a recipe book. Damn recipes, yeah. Who cares? I wouldn't uh, trust any book he's written. It's weird this is even here. Maybe we'll just appreciate an omelette. Professor Eggman. So it's going to be like egg related foods like omelettes or like ba ba cakes and stuff. Eggs Benedict. Yes. Hang in there, chat. I need to see this. Oh, did you? Aww. Look at that. Tails is getting some motivation. What's here? Oh, this is where Rouge got excited by with the brochures. Yeah, look at this. It's a couple, there's actually a couple of maps here. Huh? Okay. Map of the library card. These books are categorized by genre, which are listed here. Got the library card map now added to my inventory. Sweet. This is the map of the library right here that we're in. Ooh. Oh, okay. Ooh. What's this? A lot of these were not told by the train speed enough. Rouge pulled uh, a lot of these out to search for something. What about this behavior? I feel sorry for the poor books. Ooh, the table's though in here. Don't be so plush, but be right in the mood to read. Nice. Makes me want to take a nap personally. Ah. Apps. Don't fall asleep, but it's comfy. There's been a bit of murder, remember? If I had a ring for every time as a murder beer ruined my nap time. What the fuck? How many murder mysteries have you been part of? No, I haven't got any meats, unfortunately, but so I'm sorry. Why do you actually bring a knife? What the fuck? Do you have the knife still on you? Yeah, you've definitely been having a suspect there. Uh, can I get a bone about space? I made it to space with my beloved and antique vase, but my mistake uh, in my haze dropped this vase from my embrace, so my antique. Must be now be replaced. What going to drop the vase? Yeah, true. Oh, the vase, sorry. Don't read too deeply into it, just a poem. He hasn't fallen through though, has he? Yeah, but it's locked. Yeah, lot is added to your inventory. Okay, we got we got some more clues. Right, start the interrogation. Like, the two of you don't believe us, eh? It's a lot that we don't trust you, but I want to be a proper detective about examining the validity of your alibis. Exactly. Devil and I are here to confirm two things. Why well, I went to the left to go play games with Knuckles, and if SBO really was reading in the library car. Better, we'll start with you. Why did you leave the library to visit Knuckles? Were you uh, prepared to pre 
the evidence if needed. Oh no, that's it. I got bored. <laughs> that's it. I wasn't telling him no, so it seemed Vetsa enjoys being social. So he's an extrovert. Got it. Plus we were in short to, 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 to mingle. Remembered uh, the arcade machine was in the saloon, so we figured that we'd be you know, check it out. Okay, fair enough. That brings our attention to USBO. I rude entered the library car, found something, then left. And you immediately started reading, but were you actually reading the entire time? Were you in the library car? Of course he was. Once this people started reading, he doesn't stop till he's done. It's, uh, I've seen it happen. Must have been a good read. What was the book? Oh, doesn't all you uh, that detective let the little uh, man live? What if it was embarrassing? What kind of thing do I you think I read? Fan fiction? If you want to talk, I have a hunch on what that book might be. No, could you help me out here? I think you might have been reading the manual. Right here. Think time. Okay. All right, there we go. Now, our books are across the floor, but the remaining bookshelves from the vault were once in alphabetical order. All of this manual, meaning someone at the very least picked uh, the manual up and put it back in the incorrect place. Uh oh, his face says it all. That of attention to detail isn't normal like you, SPO. Hey, now, I won't have you insulted my pal like this. Calm down, Vetsa. I know you mean well, but I can handle myself. This is indeed the book I was reading, the Mirage Express Manual. Oh, trains are cool. Like strange chat. In that case, we'd like to ask you a question about the manual, if that's if you don't mind. Could you ask SPO some questions about the manual? Just flip the page you want to ask him about. Page 362. Okay. Walter Garms, during the events, they can perform a variety of tasks and responsible for the. Oh, no. He knows his stuff. Remember the conductor saying the train can clean itself. Though I have a feeling the train company just didn't want to hide, probably. Should company cheapen out? That sounds like about right. Uh, 89. No refunds if you uh, charge. Charge us no, no uh, show fee. This uh, does not imply if you were over the age of 65. Okay. Which page should I go for now? 402. Dodging data processing system, it works in tandem with the conductor to ensure smooth travel for guests. Damn. I guess so, yeah. They are too specific. He, he knows his stuff there. Like, there's no way he's lying. I have to admit, though, reading the entire time, uh, reading the entire time of murder, it does sound a little suspicious. Yes, it does. One could say he was some monkey. Vegeta was the only one to see you read it. Problem. Frankly, I don't believe that it could be true. Uh, we have the evidence to back it up. Lock? Okay, argument time. No, I didn't get enough. There we go. Just about did that. Holy fuck. Get the saloon and when he set the oh, there's no high school in the arcade machine. Yeah, but I ended up being here. It wasn't the high school long. As well said, he saw Shadow into the uh, library car, but he mentions nothing about Shadow's return. He only mentioned that Vetsa came back. Shadow left Knuckles, Vetsa in the saloon. SPO was fully seated reading his book for a good while at that point. You know, Shadow had to walk back through the library car when he left the, he, uh, left the saloon car. There's absolutely no way SPO and Shadow didn't notice one another on the Shadow's return trip. Well, I mean, it's a simple slip up. I was just fully immersed in my uh, book. I didn't notice Shadow. You're telling me that the sound of doors opening and locking wouldn't cause you to look up? Well, I you see. Oh, we've got him now, chat. We've, we've de detected some suspicions here. Then the argument that he was reading the entire time isn't easy. So if you didn't see Shadow return from the slip car to lock up the doors, then that, that moment where you really read in the library car at all? But how would SPO leave? Shadow locked all the doors and no one saw SPO in the saloon car. Mystery, my dear, the devil. One that I will love to SPO to this soul. That cool domain uh, is vanishing. I was so involved with uh, my book, I didn't notice Shadow pass back. Uh, right, sure. He even had to tap on the show to get me my attention. Yeah, I remember doing that. Must avenge my friend's death, so I'll ask you again, SPO. If you weren't there for Shadow to see you reading, then how did you uh, leave the library car? I wasn't, I didn't. Why wasn't this uh, scene right to me? Tails definitely feels like he's on some, but I don't see it. SPO was simply sitting reading, or did he somehow vanish to not notice Shadow's return to the library? Library car. What should I do? I'll join Tails. I'm curious. I can't interrupt Tails. Oh, the lawsuits we taught. Okay, maybe I I, I, I made a chosen wrong there. That's a piece of evidence that could answer all our problems. Okay, what evidence would that be? The map? The map then, okay. Gotcha. No, oh, come on. Oh, piss off. I jumped too soon. Boom, there we are. I got 71 coins there as well. See the exits uh, right across from one another, a straight path. Shadow walked down uh, this path. There's a way SPO and Shadow couldn't have seen one another. It's like you have to point out where exactly where the map could be. Well, the only one that I could think of is here because it's right behind here. Yeah. It's the only table that's being blocked. It's fuse being blocked. Yeah, so that's, uh, that's SPO's alibi right there then. Plus, he couldn't get out because both doors were already locked. Must have been a lot of sense that you were never mentioned uh, Shadow's return, SPO. There's no way you should have seen him. I bought it with my cool bat there. I felt like I was grasping, but yeah. Luckily, I stepped in there. This game does help you out a lot in actually like giving you the truth here rather than having different scenarios where you could like fail or anything like that or accuse someone. In Mole's there, time, but I have no further points. There we are then.
all validating and done. Gonna crash for a bit of these chairs. It's all comfy. True. Yeah, we all got to ask questions into Rude, Shadow, and Blaze. Either the doors of the next car is open. Sweet. We best get on our case then. Yep, you go do all that stuff. We're gonna go keep. Oh, God. No, not another poem. Let's just go to the murder. The, the mystery calls tales. We gotta we gotta find out who killed Sonic. Ooh. <gasps> oh, my God. There's a chow guard. Talk Sonic, eat my chili dog. Chili dogs don't sound too great, honestly, here. It's all because they're all microwaves. Rude. There you are. We have a lot to say to you. We've been sitting every train car so far. Everyone said they've seen you wandering about. Titan, you told us why. Tell me why. Why am I? Talk about a warm welcome. Which is the point, aren't you? Yeah. I see you've uh, brought the microwave master. Microwave master. Chef Mike is here, chat. Tales, it's right. Uh, folks, I've brought up uh, you a lot. Can I to explain? Oh, she's getting nervous. Tell them, Rouge. We're going to need the help. Blaze seems to be involved in this. All right, I've been hunting for a treasure room to be stored here on the train. Oh, treasure, you say? There's a part business tycoon, part prover of fine collectibles, thief. I knew that I had to find it. Tell him what it is, Rooch. All right, well, it's a fa Faberge Chowek. Hope I'm pronouncing that right. Oh, that does sound extravagant, yes. But please don't tell me that you can set the but Amy's birthday only, only, only to, it won't surprise me. Someone can have multiple goals. I gave him her birth presents already, so everything's well taken care of. Fair enough. She wrote me in on the hunt immediately. I stayed here while she was searching train cars or clues. I do that the Faberge and uh, Chowek is here in the train cars, locked in the safe. What do you manage to find, Rouge? Oh, do you both take a look? Ooh. Found this train's blueprints within the library car with the safe code written uh, on it. The score of a lifetime, but now all you have to do is find the safe. Range blueprint? Spruce uh, Rouge does see that. Uh-uh, find his keepers, sweetheart. There's a problem. We need your assistance. It's kind of a problem. The elevator behind the security guard leads us straight to the room of the Fabra J. Uh, Chowick. We're not getting anywhere without the guard's access. You mean the Chow guard right there? We need a plan to get that card to the elevator now. Chance of grow SSS grows with every one's help. So you want us to help you steal the Fabra J. Uh, Chowick. Please, you don't have a problem with this? I see no issues here. Sounds like a fine business venture. Ah, her lockdown must be influencing her decisions here. Probably not. Even though breaking the rules must be refreshing for a princess. I want to steal. Then you are now Rouge, uh, Volpe. The devil, do you uh, have any opinion on this? Stealing is for squares. It's time for a fing five finger discount. Interesting. And the only square here is you, microwave master. <laughs> Wow. That wasn't the coolest thing I've heard someone say. No, my cool of mystery is <laughs> reputation. It's crumbling. No. All right, all right, I mean, I'll help. I suppose it plays in the devil are in. Okay, we're, we're basically, we're all being roped into being thieves. Happy to see you both on the team. Now I must uh, plan. Oh, what the hell? To access the Fabergé uh, room is behind the locked elevator. The security guard has access code. Do we attack the guard, bribe the guard, or distract the guards? Let's distract the guards. We're all charming enough to do that kind of work. Fair enough. Devil, is everything okay? I've never seen you smile like that before. Yeah, she's probably just blushing. That's all. The rouge making the devil blush. And you don't know how to take a compliment. Yeah, that sounds like about my life, honestly. If I'm going to be uh, in a casino, my poker face needs work. Pa -pa -pa poker face. Okay, who's attracting the Security guards. Uh, why not Blaze? Never select a single person, and I won't falter. All right then. First you on, moving on. What's the distraction plan? Okay, pretend the claw machine is stuck. Push a bunch of poker chips to the floor. Ask Chow about their partner and kids. I feel like pretending the claw machine is stuck might be a good one. How will you get the access to the cards? Ground and fly up to the rafters. Ask for the car. Pit pocket. She's done it plenty of times before. Try to anything else. Uh, <laughs> she probably will. The guard update we need to blaze uh, out of here there. The devil, what's your plan? Push the guard over. Pretend your blazer's spouse. I do. What is your heritage? Any war crimes I should know about? Several. We can't do that one. See, there's a drink about our coaster. I can think of nothing uh, worse. This is cool. I would never allow such a thing in my kingdom. So what they're saying is they have standards. This is such a weird distraction plan, but sure, why not? Celebratory dance, pop some apple cider. I like the sound of that one, honestly. Sing victory a cappella. A cappella. Tails can disable them, right? Yeah. The arms are tying in and on their grip. Brian, hope they sympathize. Imagine you're not in pain. Pretend there's nothing wrong. Damn, I'm happy to say this plan is perfect, is it? Okay, sure. Time to execute the plan then, I guess, and see what happens. Oh, wait, did we actually get in? I was hoping we would see the plan actually unfold. God damn it. No chat on now, but we can claim our real prize. I have a safe code here, right here. Imagine it doesn't work after all that. Let's get the Fabergé then. Well, there's a big giant safe here. Are you sure it's like, is it the right safe? Oh shit, I opened very quickly. Anyone else see the uh, uh, see those? Let's get out of here. Hold up, kiddo. We can't be so hasty. You truly think that there's an order to this egg? No further secrets whatsoever. Rouge, spit it out. What are you hiding? Only three of these eggs were made ever made, each hiding their own individual secret. No one knows the secret because anyone who's opened one has never had lived to tell. Are uh, you sure you want to open it then? You can open the egg? You sure can. All of you will bear witness to its secrets. Yeah, I, I don't know if you should either. Oh. 
Uh oh. That sounds like a bomb. Why is each egg a bomb? Okay. Uh, put it in the safe and lock the door. I know, I know. Oh, oh my god, there's so many answers. Oh god, I, I, I don't know which one to choose. Throw it and lock it in the safe. Uh oh. Uh, twist the egg again. No. Let it, let it finish the egg and see what happens. I don't know. Oh. Give it to the robotic arms and they'll know. Or maybe they, like, they'll actually respond. So we all bound to watch something. We should wait and see what happens. Ah, uh, sure. Hope it don't blow up. Oh. Uh, it opened. So what, what was inside then? Oh, that's very cute. It's a chow necklace. Yeah, I bet she is because she's a thief. She wants to steal it. I wonder why the egg wasn't a bomb. Perhaps they just like legged it before they even realized. I agree. Let's get out of here before we get spotted. Yeah, Alan Hunt, that was interesting. Being thieves with these two. Yeah, let's never do that again. Oh, she's completely absorbed. She sees it as a shiny and her brain is just like shiny. How this uh blueprints, now that you're all done with them, maybe we can take a look at them. Find us keepers. I need them a little longer in case I'm missing anything over treasures, but I promise to take uh let's take a peek a little later. Okay. Don't want to sound ungrateful, but I'm sure you get it, sweetheart. <sighs> Rouge being Rouge. Shall give me and Rouge one of these. He passed through earlier. Ooh, a key. Nice. You know, we had a lot of people mention you, Rouge. We also have a just some suspicions about Shadow. You're unpredictable, that one. Good luck to you. Doors open, both of you. Say, uh, say thanks again. So we don't even have to ask some questions about what's going on here. Uh, your alibi? Hey, Blaze and I helped Melee robots her into the egg hunt. So the casino car went searching for the blueprints. I walked back through the library and saloon cards till I found out on the library car. Did you see Tonic at all during this search? Nope. In the dining car at the beginning. That's it. Do you have anything to uh, spoil that claim? Listen, plenty of people saw me poking around and I have their blueprints on me. I hardly have time to chase down something murder him and find the blueprint myself. You never know. Appreciate your honesty there. You can always thought to Blaze as well. Okay. Fab machine egg egg. We walked out to the casino car where we were, went to our separate ways. We scoped around and discovered the egg was here. So I played a slot machine in the train. Did a Susan Joe, which was well, but I didn't leave the car. Gave me my present when she stopped by. Shadow passed through as well, but it was brief. He gave me the exit, exit key and left. So I say the cash out voucher, you could not take a look. Oh, 14,000 credits? Uh, do tell Karina I said hi, won't you? Oh, yes, Karina. I guess we'll uh, find Shadow then. Lounge car. I won't. Uh, I know you won't talk, but I know exactly why you've been locking out these doors. It's hard to get a word in as you keep talking. <laughs> Oh my god, I love this sassy bastard so much. I have my reasons. I no reason is convincing in nubbits and inconceivable what you did. I think Amy suspects that Shadow is the one that killed Sonic. As he made it here, Tails. I didn't expect the iron uh, chef as well. We'll see what you say when you what your microwave chili dog is delicious. I'd also like to know why you've been locking doors for other uh, train shadow. Yeah. Well it seems Amy Claire already knows that, so ask her. I'm not saying anything. You won't uh, you lot will have to tell me why. Tell me why. Now if you can leave me be, I have an appointment coming up. An appointment? For what? I don't think Shadow's interested in talking to the devil, is she? All right, I guess we gotta look around and find some answers. What's in this wardrobe? Yeah, sure, I'll open it. Whoa, that is dusty as fuck. What's this? Oh, oh, it's a passageway. Okay, wait, it's a secret passage that leads to the library? Hidden passageway added to my inventory. That, that's an interesting thing to find now. So that means someone can live that they knew about that could sneak through and then get to the library very quickly. The Chow Band. Give us a jam. Ooh. These are the ones that Shadow has been using as a locksmith. There are two keys. I feel the locksmith would have a bunch. He'd be giving them out though, hadn't he? Yeah, let's take it. Sure. We shall take that. A printer. Wonder what it can print out. Sonic singing a song. Sonic rowing a boat. It's a very clear, but I won't let it stump me. Oh, that's cute. Look at there. Uh, what does this do? Maybe the computer's missing these to our glorious views though. True. True. I do want that sometimes myself as I am quite on my computer quite often. What's in the bin? Tell me there's something in the bin, please. We should take it. Yes. No, no, no. There must be something this time. I can feel it. Yeah. Oh. Ah. Someone printed out the front page of a ticket website. It's the uh, band Hot Honey. That's one of Amy's favorite bands. Okay. It's always success if you cash the check. The exactly. See, there you go. You think we have enough clues? Okay. Is there anything else that we can explore? We can talk to Amy and see what she said. Why took you so long to get today? But to be fair, we have had to go through locked doors. But all will be revealed in due time. Okay, so he's just got something. Jen lied on the whole case soon. Can you tell us? I hear Sharon is caring. Just Porter is always first to reveal a scoop. Okay. We're ready to challenge uh, Shadow. Talk to him, but then I'll be ready. Okay, sure. All right, we can probably interrogate Shadow first then. A stare, so cold. All right, let's start the interrogation then. We've got questions about everyone on the train and every single one person mentioned you running into you. We've been locking every door on the train and 
happened. I know why. Tell me why. Ready to tell why uh, was I locking all the doors? Time to reveal my hot tip. Hope everyone's ready for a scoop found by yours truly. Here we go. According to the map, the next car in the conductor's car where Starnik was stationed. This door right here is the lounge car. Is this the only one, the door that leads to the conductor's car following? Yes. So Shadow was locking all the doors for one reason, one reason alone. To keep Sonic from escaping the conductor's car. We found Sonic in the dining car. I think he was trapping Sh uh, Sonic. I don't know what other locked doors were suspicious. Pure conjecture. You all get, get out and leave me be. My source can back me up here, these lanes. They will remain anonymous, but I think who was your source? In the, they never saw Sonic again after he went to the conductor's car. Why? Because he was trapped and couldn't leave the conductor's car. Reckless speculation. I'll play along and follow this train of logic for Amy. The Shadow did lock the door to the conductor's car in prison in Sonic. And how was Sonic found in the dining car? Exactly. Yeah, he's got a point there. Ben Dillon can explain the car change, however. Shadow looks worried there. Devil, what happens do we have the Shadow that search or Sonic could have uh, gone to the dining car? Uh, the secret passageway, maybe? Okay. 55 coins. Booyah! The devil and I found a hidden passage in the wardrobe that leads in right to the library car. What? So well, someone could have uh, used the passage, snuck through the library car, walked past the direction boys were playing arcade, and safely arrived at the dining car. You know, I just had a thought. What if Sonic is unconscious because he's in a food coma? I'm eating too many chili dogs. He might have like snuck through, went through the secret compartment uh, exit, and then like got into the dining car and then eating all the food. This adjusts, this adjusts my experience a little bit. Yes, sure. So, uh, so Shadow Merger did have Sonic in the guts of car, but then thought this crime scene was a bit sus being so close to the station was suspicious. Shadow picked up uh, Sonic locked the door to the conductor's car on the way out and dropped the body. No, I don't believe that either. You're accusing Shadow of being the murderer, huh? Uh, am I? But of course, this is just a theory. A game theory. Uh, I uh, don't have any evidence to back this up other than my hot scoop. Tim Sales and I were more thorough than you. Shadow's not going to talk now. I'll humor you once again. Shadow traveled through the hidden passage and appeared in the library car. And how did SPO and Vector not see him? Well, um, so yeah, your, your evidence is getting flawed here. I suppose it would be hard to think around two people. Devil, do you have any uh, questions? Yeses. Oh, well, SVO and Vector didn't see Shadow because... Well, Vector was with Knuckles, but then SVO was reading. As we're in the library checks out, that's what we uh, told me to. Yeah. He's lying. At whatever game I left the saloon car, when I, I spent some time looking for SVO where he wasn't there. He was not... In oh. So Shadows can now confirm that SVO actually wasn't there the entire time. I believe you. You're currently my number one suspect. Why were you even searching for SPO, huh? If you must know, I need to give him a key. As if, why would uh, Locksmith be giving away his keys? Shadow's been giving away a lot of keys, actually. Everyone but us seems to have one. Didn't know that Shadow's been passing out keys? Perhaps the and I can further validate like, Shadow's claim. But Evan Sport Shadow's claim that he was giving away keys. This right here, the key ring. Well, oh, he's 60 now. There we go. There's only one reason there's exactly the two keys on that key ring. Those were the key, two keys Shadow were meant to give SPO and Vector. Well, what was it? Well, what of his own key? Couldn't one of those be for him? I have my own key uh, on me. Oh, there you go then. Let's say Shadow's still untrue. The then what? We have to question SPO. Shadow didn't murder, so I bring him to the dining car. Then what possible reason could he have for locking all those doors? He's right. A very strong. Tails and I certainly haven't pres presented all possibilities. Is Shadow really innocent in Sonic's murder? The devil I know exactly why Shadow's locking all the doors. I have a question for you. Hmm. Has everyone today given you a birthday present? Mostly everyone. Everyone's been so sweet. Some Shadow and Sonic haven't given me anything yet. Was that thing that we've found in the bin the thing that he was going to give to Amy as a present? Uh, this would be the one that I have, right? Shadow couldn't find it. Shadow wanted to keep us away. Was he trying to keep Amy away and that's what it was? My birthday. You know it's my birthday, right? Don't you, Shadow? How dare you? The devil show me everything. Show me the present. Shadow's keep trying to keep me away. Prove it. You've been so far in there whatsoever. What proof do you have? This thing right here. Crumbled up paper. Think time. Time chat. We must use our brain power. All right, we made it. Just holy crap. Women rooting through the trash? Yes. I always check out every bin just in case. The band's ticket website. Tails, don't. It's the hot honey website. No way. I love them. I think I know what Shadow was trying to get for a present. He was trying to get tickets for her favorite band. Yeah, Jeremy B is uh, ah, my favorite. The tickets are really hard to get. You have to be ready online. That's a bit time and they sell out in minutes. So the question becomes, why was this paper found in the trash can that Shadow was stationed in? Watch yourself, Fox. Ooh. So it's becoming more clearer. 
don't know how Tiggles figured out to Tiggles out soon, but I see where he's heading to. Shadow was a big hot honey fan. Shadow was buying tickets for Amy. Are you trying to get me a concert tickets for my birthday? Yep. <laughs> That's actually quite cute. Shadow was trying to get concert tickets for Amy as a present. Use that print out uh, earlier and I found it difficult to manage. When I logged onto the website, did you print the homepage by accident? Outlook? Yes, that's exactly what happened. So he accidentally pressed print rather than get, <laughs> pressing getting the tickets. So I guess we just uncovered a little secret plan of his to get tickets for <laughs> AB's favorite band, except for me. Wrote for my social status, I immediately began brainstorming ideas and saw the computer. I maybe have never seen Hot Honey live and fucked it up, but when I had... That's when I accidentally printed the homepage. Not that were actually on sale, I realized, but I would have been available to you. At any point when you kept speaking, though, the time you were able to actually buy the concert tickets. Precisely, I haven't purchased the tickets yet. I knew I had to keep any away while I waited to buy the tickets, so I began looking, locking all the doors. Okay, Shadow is, a, Shadow is a himbo, let's put it like this. But for the safety of everyone, I handed out keys so they could get in and out. So that's why he was also handing out keys. It was the manager to man, uh, make it here somehow, because she has the master key. Yeah, the country gave her the master key right here. The fans fatal floor, the birthday key. Yep, it was. Should have guessed. It's a well known privilege. Mm hmm. Yep, birthday girl and all. Shout out, like, your gesture is still sweet, and after all, I accuse you. Yeah, you put your own apology. Make it out to you, you can come with me. Huh? I don't know if. Too late, it's happening. <laughs> The introvert's being dragged out with the extrovert chat. Happy birthday, Amy. <laughs> Aw, that's cute. Yeah, I spell out pictures as well, so, you know. I want that too. And my source for all this, that was one of the hot top uh, that all lead me to believe Shadow was behind everything. Yeah, who was your source though, Amy, then? Yeah, I would like to know that as well. Maybe it's sure, but my principles may say intact. I have a strong feeling I know exactly who your source is. We need to investigate one last area, the conductor's car. True. Well, Shadow is now also joining us. I'll join as well. Yes, we're all gonna join now. Time for the end, chat. I guess the conductor's uh, thing is there. All right, chat, last room. The conductor's car. Where's, uh, is the conductor here as well? He's not here, that's strange. Time to investigate. Let's crack on. Okay, let's have a look around then. Oh my God, Shadow always has to have some kind of like pose. He's such a poser. Did it actually fall? Not sure, that's a good question. Did the mug actually fall? Edgy sitting, yeah. What's this uh, cinema? The cup of Joe in your hand, wife by your side, paradise. He loves his wife, true, he does. Uh... This arm appears to be completely torn off. That's strange. Yeah, it's also the break. Confidential uh, confrontation definitely occurred in this room. We should log this into. Okay. The broken arm has been added to the inventory. Sweet. May as well check the bin. We must check the bin, chat, to see if there's anything in there. Nothing in there. Now everyone's talking about the bin. <laughs> yeah, this is when the conductor first died, for being a conductor from the looks of it. 32 years on the job. Damn. May any future sorrow be fleeting. Damn. Yeah, they couldn't drive the shit. The car has every function on the train like the conductor can. Did they teach you how to drive? No. <laughs> Just how to use the microwave. Hmm, maybe you could drive the train. You probably could, Taz, if you watched to work it out. Is it true you could drive this uh, train flawlessly? Oh, thanks, guys. That's cute. Okay, here's the screen right here. You use it to show information and advertisements. A nice the picture there is really clear. I want to watch every full movie on it once. Let's watch um, Frozen. My phone. We can talk to the whole train with this. Hmm, should I say something? Oh my god, stop beatboxing. bossing. Yeah, yeah, armpit stinks. <laughs> yeah, I wanted to do that too. I just wanted to do both there, chat. Ooh, what's this? It's a blow dart, okay. Oh, interesting. And that's when the arm attacked. That's why that arm was ripped off. They can know about that blow dart. Let's talk to Shadow before we talk to Amy. Yeah, it is very odd. I agree. Perhaps that was the, the reason why the train sped out so quickly was because of the struggle. Uh, the train conductor was taken away. All right, let's talk to Amy. I think we have enough evidence now. Everyone reports that there's a conductor at once. I think the only person we have to actually question right now is Espio. Wonderful to have you all here. Tails and I are uh, ready to announce our prime suspect. Why hasn't Sonic shown up? Is he still uh, passed out? Can you go get <laughs> Come with me to get Sonic. He must be still pretending to be dead, lazy bum. Yeah, let's go get a Sonic real quick. The area in this uh, here is so intense. I love it. Nothing like the thrill of a mystery. The train has so many... Uh... <laughs> Amenities? Nearly, I've been having a lot of fun myself. The amusement is a lot of this. I got to admit, this game is a lot of fun. If you haven't checked this game out, chat, please do so. It is free. We're going to do an event like this again. It says, uh, here the train does escape rooms. Oh, I like. I do like a good escape room. Oh, what the fuck? Is Sonic actually dead? I guess he's actually dead. Wow, damn. Which one did this Sonic on my birthday, no less. Oh, shit, she got the mallet out. We're going to figure this out what exactly what happened in this room. Punish the one who was responsible. Yeah, he was actually really hurt the whole time, chat. And we did nothing about it. Fuck. Who killed Sonic the Hedgehog? So the only one that I suspect out of everyone is Espio. Because 
the main clue that we have is that Espio's claimed that he was reading whilst everyone was out the room, but Shadow confirmed that he was not in the room when he passed through the room. Plus, there's a secret door that we found leading to the train car area. So I think Espio is the murderer. Here we go. Uh, we discovered a hidden passage. The hidden passage was discovered in the lounge. So we had to that. That could be actually one way we could have done it. It would put him straight where he needed to be too. How did Espio know if in the train manual he was reading? He's a poet, so he's a quick reader. And he would definitely know about a secret compartment possibly from the manual. What are you getting at? You get they put a random book from the shelf and memorized it. Just to guarantee yourself a clean alibi. That's absurd, memorizing a whole book. I know this is a talented bunch, but that seems like a lot. I see known as for a long time. He, uh, he once fed around an entire book I was reading just to spoil the entire ending for me. Damn, what a bitch. If I'm right, SPO and SPO quickly memorized the book before entering the hidden passage. And SPO could have met Sonic in the conductor's car where he was murdered. Since we're talk only talking in uh, water tears, let me throw something at you. Uh, how was I to know about the hidden passage? It's hidden. That's right. How would SPO have known it was there? For yourself, kid, you were lucky to even find the passage. Devil and I may not have uh, answered your question, but we know someone who does, the devil. Uh, who here has the evidence to prove SPO knew about the hidden passage? Shadow the Hedgehog, right? Okay. Was it you, Tails? Amy? No. Vector? No. Rouge? The blueprints. Okay, of course. The blueprints have been added to my inventory now. Yeah, they exposed the hidden passage. I guess we all have seen those blueprints. Found them before Rouge did. SPO swiped them from the conductor. The blood, they could have gone onto the conductor the entire time. Therefore, that's how he managed to get them. Found them out of the passage and then stuffed them away somewhere. That's when Rouge found them and then saw the code on them. Yeah, he did discover. She, Rouge just discovered them on the. Yeah, it's, it's all coming together now, chat. After multiple guesses and tries, SPO looked at the blueprints and then used the hidden passage to get to Sonic. When uh, Amy's guidelines, the murderer can kill a single participant however they chose so just the, 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 the logistics i still uh vague with the devil and i have done something about how murder sonic was murdered not sure how uh, much harm i feel caused on it but the devil and i have done something how it was done if i murdered sonic how did i do it slow darts all right time to think chat nice oh my god oh, i didn't get enough coins again didn't get enough coins until i oh god no Oh fuck, you, oh, fuck you, game. There you go. That's enough coins there. God damn, that took a few attempts. The world I found here in the conductor's room. I believe SPO uses the knocks on it unconscious. So that means... So that might just be knocked out? Yeah. Very, very knocked out. He's more banged up than uh, what Wildar would do. Contact me as a result of Wildar uh, accounts the kill for the murder mystery. A theory, therefore, is plausible. Plausible, you say, then why uh, are there so many holes in it? Deny the allegations? Of course I do. Let me present the first fertile floor. If I knocked out Sonic in the conductor's car, then how was Sonic found in the dining car? I told the doors and SVO didn't have a key, he would have uh, had to take the hidden passage back. If the hidden passage back, he would end up in the library. No other way it could be uh, been done. We do? Piece of evidence you have to take a closer look. A robotic hand? No. Blueprints? Time for think, chats. Oh, balls. What? Ah, oh, shit. Missed it by that much. There we go. Didn't take us many times that time. Didn't take the six passage to get to the dining car. Then what route did he take to get to the side of Sonic? There, there's a path above the dark and the car and it goes all the way to the dining car. Is that the same sort of attic? Yeah. From onto these blueprints, there's a hidden passive path in the ceiling that leads straight to the dining car. Through the vent over there. I didn't realize the vent was there, actually. Allow me to check it. Oh, shit. There's a path back here and a track. Track for the robot arm, I believe, I think. It must be the path the arms were take to move the road of their train. Like I was saying, they somehow fit to... Was Sonic in the vent took him to the dining car. Tells you were smart kids, so I know you realize we'd uh, both couldn't fit up there. And he's getting dragged around here. I don't know if I get uh, Sonic through the vent. How about the robot arm? Okay. Because the robot arm was ripped off. Yeah, I lost too many coins there. No! I was so fucking close. Fuck you, game. Oh my god, no. There you go. There you go, that's not it. Everyone saw the broken robot arm on the ground, right? Yep. Clearly a fire was broken out. Uh, one of those robots was uh, casualty. But what if one of the robot arms actually caught Sonic? No, no cause says there's a track on the robot arm using that the continuous with the vent. The robot arm could have grabbed Sonic, passed out from the blow dart, and carried him to the dining car. Could that be true? It could be. Hey, little Sonic, he's clearly banged up. Could the fire have been uh, between Sonic and the robot arm? Well, it doesn't fall easily, but if he's woozy from a uh, blow dart, that <laughs> Yeah, the arm could be in a real good, it's true. There isn't theory, but you have to admit these are a lot of coincidences. I'll not be able to link everything directly to SPO yet, but I have one final consistency. Someone uh, have received false information. I believe that information came from SPO. Who received that information? Amy. Amy, you received hot scoop, did you not? 
It's like you told us who the scoop came from. As people lied to me. Oh, shit. Oh, here we go. Yeah, here we are. Now we're exposing the truth here. Of course not. Amy must have misheard me. Misheard you? Yes, I said uh, someone's going to get trapped with all these locked doors. I was looking around for my fellow passenger safety. I didn't blame Shadow. I don't know, SVO. What? The evidence might not be at sight, but there's a lot thrown uh, at you that makes sense. I agree. You want us to believe you're lazy <laughs> reading the whole time while you were stationed in the room in a hidden passage now you're listening to me on my birthday oh no the mallet's coming out i believe the murderer used the train controls to move sonic from the cousin's car to the dining car and live day casting further blame on shadow for no other reason than to cause doubt and confusion when examining everyone in the alibi one skill stands out as the weakest there could only be one person it was you svo jacques you were the one who murdered sonic the hedgehog oh shit sonic hey sonic's awake chat sonic you're okay and sonic just as we solved the mystery SPO was the murderer? SPO jumped me in the conductor's car. SPO left me there. I need everyone to listen. The train's abandoned it. Wait, what? Do you need to lie down, back down? No, we need to get off this train. We're not safe. What? When I arrived at the conductor's car, the conductor was already here. He was ex uh, so excited to tell me about all the features of the train. But he also was telling me that I had a bad feeling. I asked him to see the power source. The conductor hadn't uh, even seen it. When we took a look, we realized the train's powered by a, a flicky? Wait, really? Eggman? Yeah, Eggman, of course. E e of course it's going to be Eggman. Eggman's going to be the, always the villain here. Gravity is more than the simple bad Nick. It's a good old friend. The trainer is his, is his co-conductor. They uh, certainly did not tell me that in the interview. No. Right, it's all the flicky I saw. A sting in my uh, shoulder was blown off from SPO. Well, that was awkward then. The lights in the room started to go red. Oh. Oh, the conductor got taken by the robots. That's why he broke the arm. Yeah, we all know that. Well, that's how these kind of games worked. You shoot your someone with blood out, they die. Are you crazy? It just makes a uh, believe game. Yeah, it's true. Yeah, it was just a game. I just following the rules. Use the blood out on the conductor. He was released with non lethal sleep nation. Thank you again for the choosing the Mirage staff. Gonna think of it. One of the robotic arms getting it to me. Huh. And you didn't find that suspicious at all? Um, the train itself or the, the conductor got taken. The train itself could have been the orchestrator behind the scenes. I mean, the train could be controlled by Eggman. Oh, God. Amy's not impressed that this is happening on her birthday. Well, the fuck oh that looks like eggman okay the trade can talk oh to eggman's base we're going all going to eggman's base oh once again it's always eggman i guess we're arriving at eggman's base Ooh. Have we arrived? Hi, Sonic. How are you doing? So I was just very confused there. Hang in there, but it seems the train arms threw all us back into the dining car. Huh. Things aren't looking the brightest. No, but we're in the situation in the dark. It's up to us to shine the way forward. Aren't you inspirational, Sonic? Get our bearings and take a look around. Good idea. Lead the way. One of those robot arms are here. Yeah, true. You are right there. Any way out? Nope, they're all sealed shut. Yeah, that yellow glow is quite unsettling there. That's Eggman. Oh shit, it's Eggman. Mr. Yellow Glow already. Got some of those showing up here, Eggman. Egghead. Oh, you spiky blue pest. Seems you finally taken passage on one of my passenger trains. You created this train? Who the heck are you? Don't talk to me. Ow, you bitch. My involvement isn't a uh, well known civilian. The infrastructure in your towns uh, wasn't just cutting it. If I were to build uh, Egg Eggman Land, these very problems would have uh, been sorted out. How about you use your knowledge and to actually help people rather than just capturing the hedgehog that is Sonic? They convert some cargo trains to passenger trains for the sake of the public. It's more useful for future schemes. Let me guess, another death egg, Dr. Predictable. Uh, people fear giant spears. It's science. How cutting edge. All lots of in the cars I was stationed in. Seems you managed to make the train quite uh, upset. You noticed what's happening? You did not notice what's happening? Heavens no, I'm not. Uh, I'm only now just getting caught up. I'm far too busy to notice what passenger train is up to. The capability of the bandits, uh, bandits is uh, normally very, very basic. Just kill the hedgehog. But for a luxury train, I wanted to be sure things ran without my supervision. I report to be if anything uh, happened aboard. The train's capability of int intellectual force is extraordinary. A feat would be only accomplished by my genius. The train is an AI sentient that basically had a mind of its own. Suffice to say, your capture is inevitable. You're on a train that desires no more than to deliver you all to me. But I got to thinking. I needed manufactured motivation beyond uh, programming. Have you tried listening to the buried light? Light to make band and it's complete against one another from time to time. It's purely with productivity. Did you not learn from Sonic Frontiers? No. So I instituted a bounty on 
and upon uh, my army of bandits. First catch your pathetic uh, creature gets a generous reward. Upgrades, maybe? Most of was asked for something simple like an autograph or whatever, but a highly intelligent train may ask for something more interesting. It sounds like this train wants to ride around with his conductor forever. What does I would like to reward for all grounds are you done blabbering, Doc? You never win just silently, can you? When you're to my base, uh, you'll regret the day you ever cross me, Hedgehog. I already do. Get lost. Ciao! This is tough. The train has uh, motivation and being uh, made by Eggman. It's no doubt to be powerful. Not to mention, we're all separated. The train personally had Sonic knockout so he could deliver us to Eggman. This whole time we were in danger and I went along with it. Yeah, I feel guilty. I feel bad. Didn't try hard enough. I should have done more. Until the situation getting to you. Aw, oh, Sonic gave me some inspiration. We're all getting tough. It's quite questioning the decisions that you got here. But when the negative force hits you, let it pass and keep living. Honestly, inspiring words, Sonic. Can you help me through this before I do something rash? See, I'm the one that leaves before you think, kind of guy. Ah, we always know. We know that for a fact. Let's keep moving forward and make things right. Yes. Breathe. But how do we get through? Believe in yourself. What would you do? You could probably try and break through it. Oh, yeah, that works. Gotta hold on to your pants. I don't think we'll be again around. <laughs> no break after this. All right, then let's go. End this mystery once and for all. Well, we've already ended the main mystery. Like SPO was the murderer, but now we're in and the mystery of you know Eggman. Interesting. So I guess we're going to be doing this then. Yeah, I need more coins than that. Yes. I just got 50 there. No the door broken. Hell there, Knuckles. Oh, I get it. So we're literally just like breaking through everything then and collecting all our friends together. God damn it. Two coins away. Yeah. I need to do this again. No enough rings. Again, because I keep losing rings. There we go. No door broken. We got SVO. We got Vets back. Now I got 60 coins to collect. Ah. Not enough coins. Damn it. Ah, oh, fuck you. Boom. That's enough Ooh. coins right there. There we go. Next door, we got Blaze and Rouge back on our sides. Just one more, I think, right? Shadow. Hell yes. First try. Why didn't Shadow also just break out as well? He has the power, same powers as Sonic, right? All right. Last one. There we go. Just about. Reading the book most likely. Sure. Doing an SPO there. All right. There we go. We got Emmy and Tails. Time to finish this then. I thought we'd have to go like every single one doing like an individual puzzle, but it turns out no. We just have to do like a lot of like traveling and coin collecting I must dispose of these uh of them to begin the uh, plans for eggman land and, and probably another death egg what the fuck don't teleport us to the future don't turn us into robots i haven't done that in a while maybe i will turn you on to robots to give sage uh some new toys to play with sage shut up eggman don't spoil me train hurry it up i will not fail my wish will be granted no wish oh you mean the bounty i don't care what you call it just bring me well uh, these overgrown mammals wow everyone's getting my wish i will not fail taking this thing down all right, time to fight, chat. Ooh, okay. 65 coins. Oh, God. That's kind of creepy, honestly. Ah, Gotta try again there. Ah, balls. Ah, three coins away. Hell yeah. No. There you go. None of you could possibly understand. So much to be together our whole lives. How could we just uh, leave it like it was nothing? What do you mean, the conductor? He's retiring. You just have to accept that. Much will uh, keep us together forever. That's what will be in. He's going to die, though, eventually. Like, he's retiring for him to be happy. You can't force someone to be friends with uh, you. That's messed up. Shut up. Just shut up. Okay. Round two, chat. He's throwing all these balls on me. The balls are definitely hard. Whoa. Okay. Definitely got enough coins there. Eggman, Eggman, can you hear me? I wish, I wish, I wish. May the conductor never leave me. Let us be friends forever. The kind of friends who will never leave each other. Why would he betray me? Oh, shit. That robot's starting to lose a little, little bit of touch of reality there. Yes. Just about. Conductor. You promise. You promise. Let him speak. Unhand him. Brain, stop this. When I told you we'd be together forever, I was a much younger man. I'm getting old. I'm tired. Excuses. How dare you abandon me? I'll be lonely. So lonely. Why must you insist loneliness upon me? No, stop. What are you doing to me? Oh shit, please do not make me do this. What are you gonna do to the conductor there? Okay, we gotta try and catch up. One more stay. Oh sh oh no! Wait, what? Okay, okay. Not enough coins. Shit. Oh crap, no. No, I'm three coins away. If I hadn't lost those coins, I might have actually had a chance. God damn it. Fuck. Fuck! Yeah, that was even worse than the last one. There we go. That's better. Alright, we're close. Ooh! We're going on attacking. The birds. A flicky. Does that be the law card? Well, anyway, my expert, best friend, left detective to work to join the dog, the Eggman. Yeah, it is. Well, it's kind of ironic how it, like, turned out to be, you know, very matching to the story. We've got to save him. On it. 
Let's show our full power. Oh shit. We're all working together here. Fuck you. Ah oh, shit. Shit. It gets so chaotic towards the end. Yes. Yes. There we go. Oh, okay. Here we go. Just be delivered to Eggman already. What about what about my happiness? Your happiness comes to the expense of others. Last I checked, that's called being selfish. Me? Selfish? How dare you? Now we're up to 100 coins. Come on. Ah, balls. Ah. 91. Fuck. There we go. There we are. 102. That'll do. Come on. Please be the last one. Please be the last one now. No, 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 no. No. Grab the flicky. Oh, you got it? It's over. Time to repay for it. Yeah, and also save the conductor's life, Amy. Wow, that's a hell of a shot. With love. God damn. You okay, Amy? Oh. Don't worry, Sonic's got you. They think it's completely destroyed, not slow down. Well, uh, that's what you get for messing with my special day. Amy's ego there, chat. I just couldn't bear to see you go. Poor robot. You just wanted to, to hang out with the conductor forever. I think our work here is done. Now let's get this uh, off this thing. Bye, my friend. Maybe leaving the rails, but I assure you, I will never forget our time together. Aw, that's cute. Even after all that you've done. Oh god, the train's a little busted, but it's, I'm sure it can be repaired. We did it. We did it. We did it. Yay. Uh, I've never been on a train like that before. The universe has a unique way of doing... Yeah, true, it does, play. Watch your step, watch your step. It's over. I'm pretty sure the devil's out of the job as well, chat. The mystery of Sonda Hedgehog's murder is officially over. Maybe next day, birthday will uh, just ask Vanilla. Or maybe we'll do an escape room, perhaps. You'll like parties where we, by the end, someone's trying to kill you? Uh, I'd rather not have that on the party, honestly. Oh, look. It's a conductor's wife. I honestly never believe what happened. So I wouldn't, uh, I wouldn't even try. <laughs> That's cute. So glad you're all here. Quick, quick. We leave uh, Spagagonio in the morning. You need to pack. Oh, God. Really? You were working that well, like, on the day before you have to leave the airport? Jesus. Hey, you home. Happy uh, first day of retirement, dear. Happy for them both. Same. Oh, who's this? An old friend, I think. Oh, they're actually the cutie. Are they going to keep the birds? It's like, like a friend, a pet. That's cute. Great job saving that little guy, SPO. Uh, it was the least I could do. Uh, as Sonic, everyone, I sincerely apologize for the trouble I caused. I think we all didn't realize what was going on, honestly, so it's fine. You were just following what you thought was the game. Yeah, exactly. It wasn't SBO's fault. I don't know what could have happened in that same situation. Nothing. Wouldn't have hit someone with a blow dart. It would have been hard to get close to you otherwise, Mr. Speed of Sound. True. But it's a one idea of fun. You should see what the other games. Holy shit. Why am I starving? If I forgot, we have uh, never ate. Of all the class, I forgot, uh, completely forgot I was hungry. If only you could serve, see me, Sonic. I was finding clues, presenting evidence, poking holes in alibis. Sonic, wait, where did you go? Hey, guess what, everyone? The station has a bakery, and look what I bought. Happy birthday, Amy. Oh, that's cute. The confident, unshakable, and radiant Amy Rose. The adventure of the birthday, darling. The memorable party you every year. To a birth on birthday. Arrive from start to finish. May our friendship grow stronger each celebration. The poem from SBO that I admire your tenacity. May you li never lose your vivacity. Happy birthday, Amy, and her sparkling personality. I'm not sure that's what I know to know. Pers personality is a word. It probably isn't. It probably is. Who knows? We love her. Uh, Amy, happy birthday. Aww. So cute. We almost got murdered by a lone train, but I wouldn't trade these adventures for anything. Never in a million years. You guys want to ever leave me right? Let's have some cake. Absolutely. Cake indeed. Oh! <laughs> okay. Everyone didn't succeed. Yeah. But uh, that's so cute. Metal Sonic, let's say, and Sage having Let's Go Dad t shirts. That's so adorable. Depends on making it here, is it? Nope. All what? Prepare a bath. The happy rubber dog or the angry one? Angry! That was choice, your evilness. Shut up. That's my story of when I met Sonic and his friends. Entangled in their lives for a fleeting moment, then back to things as they were. Today's realized Sonic was, everyone was running the train system and fought back to seize control. Everything was sweet and clean now. As for me, I stuck with the gig. Practice my singing. One million's in the lottery. Managed to fly to space. Sure, that is as your life. Yes, I'll I'll accept that. And that's it, chat. The murder of Sonic the Hedgehog, the game. Honest answer, that was a pretty good game. Like a pretty good little slice of life um game. And it's kind of cool how they made this like so quickly and made it for like an April Fool's thing and everything. Not a long game, but still great. The art style was fantastic. I really loved the banter as well. I really like that end little bit as well. We see Eggman with like the Sage and Metal Sonic say, so let's go dad, because they've hoping that the train was going to arrive with all the, the old Sonic and his friends. It was cute. I also like they got to name your character as well. I just name mine the devil because of the old the nap cube like sketch. Yeah. I do wish there was more like scenarios though. I wish there was kind of like more, uh, alternate endings and stuff. Other than that, 
good game. And also, chat, as I said, it is free to play. So if you haven't played it yet, it shouldn't take too much to run as well. Uh, make sure to download it on Steam. And of course, happy April Fool's Day.